And hello everyone, here is teacher Frank for your weekly English lesson. How are you this week? Me, I'm fine, very happy to be with you. And I hope so in November we will meet at school, I hope so, but normally it's okay. So let's do this again on online lesson and next we will be together, okay? So let's take a look on the lesson for this week. So today we continue on unit four, obviously. Okay, so first we will make a fast review with your book page, 33 plus my pages. Okay, so about cardinal numbers and ordinal numbers. Okay, then uh, we will play with the days and the months of the year. Okay, so I prepare a game for you with questions. So be careful, stay tuned. Stay focused. We start now. Okay, so fast, fast, fast about cardinal numbers. Okay, so you can keep this chart with you. Okay, with the cardinal numbers 1 to 50. Okay, so you can take a look and practice. Then continue with the cardinal numbers. 51 to 100 and more, like 1,000, take a look on the right, 10,000, 100,000, and 1 million. Start to be pretty huge. <laughs> okay, so cardinal numbers, take a look on that. Then we take a look on the ordinal numbers. Uh, so be careful. Now you know that you know the difference between the cardinal numbers and the ordinal numbers. Okay, so cardinal numbers, I repeat one more time. Cardinal numbers one, two, three, four, five, one million, and the ordinal numbers, the first, the second the third, the fourth, the fifth, and you continue, <laughs> okay? So be careful, cardinal and ordinal one, okay? Now we continue because it's a fast review, so we go fast. A fast look on the, these charts, okay? So take a look on that because this is the exercise we did last week. Okay, so let's repeat this. One first, five fifth, eight eighth, two second, three third, nine ninth, twelve twelve. And take a look now how to write it. Okay, okay, we continue. Now, a uh, fast warm up, okay? Do you know what is a warm up? It's when you will exercise. So before that, you, you warm your hand, your fingers, your neck, okay? It's a warm up before the exercise, okay? Or before you will play basketball or something like that, uh, football, anything around sports. Let's start. And obviously, a good, uh, a good exercise and keep practicing on your skills when you're ready. So you repeat after me, okay? Let's go. <laughs> what is the first day of the week? Sunday. I not agree with that because it's Monday, okay? So it's not the first week of the day. It's the first day of the week. I don't agree with that, but anyway, it's Sunday, but <laughs> I think it's Monday, huh? What is the last day of the week? Saturday, mm, okay? <laughs> okay, but normally it's Sunday, no? 
What is the first month of the year? January. Okay, <laughs> I agree with that. What is the last month of the year? December. Okay. <laughs> What is the 10th month of the year? October. Okay. <laughs> okay, so take that for something real. Okay. The first day of the week, Sunday, and the last day of the week, Saturday. Okay. I prepare an exercise and I say that the first day of the week is Monday and the last day of the week is Sunday. Okay. Now we can start to play the game. Yes. Okay. So you see my arrow below on the left. <laughs> it starts on Monday, okay? So if you answer Sunday or Monday for the first day of the week, I say, okay. And the same uh, about the last one, okay? So you click on pause. No need to use paper or pencil or something like that, okay? Just try to answer with a sentence. Uh, what day is before Saturday? And you answer the same for the mounts. What is the first mount? And you can answer like this. Okay, pause and see you after for the answer. Okay, here we are. So we start with the days of the week. Okay, so on the left. What day is before Saturday? Before Friday. What day is after Wednesday, Thursday? What day is after Sunday, Monday? What day is before? <laughs> Moving the fingers. Before Tuesday, Monday. What day is two days after Thursday, Sunday? So two days. So Thursday. Friday, Saturday, so two days after Sunday. What day is before Monday? Sunday. What day is after Monday? Tuesday. What day is before Thursday? Wednesday. What is the first day of the week? Here we are. <laughs> so Monday, uh, with the, the example before Sunday. So if you say Sunday or Monday, it's okay. And independent people, huh? it's seen that in uh, America or Great Britain, they count like this Sunday to Saturday and not Monday to Sunday. Okay, so Sunday or Monday, it depends where you are on earth. It depends your location, really. What day does school begin? Monday. Uh, we go to Le Pania the first day on Monday. Now we can talk about the month. So what is the first month? January. What is the seventh month? July. What is the twelfth month? December. Be careful with your tongue and your two front teeth. The seventh month. Yes, uh, don't forget. What is the twelfth month? Not easy. December. What is the tenth month? October. What is the third month? March. What is the sixth month? June. What is the 11th month? November. What is the second month? February. What is the fifth month? May. What is the eighth month? August. Okay, not so difficult. Okay, but it's good because you can practice with before, after, and Obviously, the pronunciation with 
TH. Uh, so TH, you must use your tongue and the tongue must stick a little bit on your two front teeth, then go back. First month, month, you see? I put it, then up, I go behind fast. Okay, practice. <laughs> And for this week, the lesson is over. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed that. And we will meet maybe on a video. I don't know yet uh, if we have some holidays or not. So I will see that, obviously. Before that, study well, learn well, and take care of you and your family. See you next week. Bye.